Well, uh, our top priority, the only clinical priority that we focus on right now as our top priority is the prevention of veteran suicide. And we are taking the approach that until we can see results that are de decreasing that number and getting it to zero, we have to be open to new ideas or, that are out there or therapies that may help. Uh, I wish that I thought it was going to be a simple uh, one pill is going to fix this. I don't believe that's going to happen. I believe that this is going to be a multifactorial approach, which means that we have to be open to all sorts of new ideas. Now, the issue of medical marijuana uh, from the federal government point of view is one that right now we are prohibited by law from doing research on it or prescribing it. So this is an area where actually the states are going to be leading in this because as it is increasingly being, um, laws are being passed at the state level to use medical marijuana, we are seeing increasingly not only more clinical data coming out, but we are seeing more research that's being done. And so as a physician scientist, I am extremely interested in learning from that data and trying to see, is this something that could help and could help veterans? Uh, but in this case, we are not going to be out there doing that research or prescribing these, uh, these different medicinal preparations unless the laws change.